everyone, welcome to the Plant Power Cyclist YouTube channel, I'm Andy. Today we're going to continue my trip from this point and explore some amazing places like Annie, Cars, and the Devil's Castle. Enjoy! After climbing up 350 meters, I came to one of the few examples left of historical Turkish palaces remaining today. It is one of the most distinguished and magnificent examples of the 18th century Ottoman architecture and is very valuable in terms of art history. According to the top of the door inscription at the harm section, it was constructed in 1784 according to the Islamic calendar. This palace was built in an age when castles ceased to be special because firearms were developed and abundantly available. Therefore, the main gate is one of its weakest points. The structure of the main gate is no different than those seen in the palaces built in Istanbul and elsewhere in Anatolia. The history of Ani dates back to 5000 BC. During the most prosperous times in the 10th and 11th centuries, it had a population of over 100,000 as it flourished as a branch of the Silk Road. However, in 1236, Ani was captured and sacked by the Mongols. By the 14th century, the city had been ruled by several dynasties and was damaged by an earthquake, but later became part of the Ottoman Empire in 1579. In 1878, the Kars region was incorporated into the Russian Empire. During World War I, the Ottoman armies fought and captured Kars. However, Ani was under the control of Armenia. After the Treaty of Kars in 1921, Ani became part of the Republic of Turkey. Many excavations have been carried out, starting back as early as 1892, and most recently in 2005. In 2016, it was added to the UNESCO World Heritage List. Everyone working in and around Ani treated me so nicely. I was given food, able to shower, and the security guards guaranteed my safety. There was security there 24 hours a day in case someone would come and try to vandalize or steal. A special thanks to my friend Fati, who brought me dinner both nights I was there. Kars Castle has a lot of the same history as Ani. Today it has free entry and some of the best views in town. Some days it was just rain and rain and rain. What do you think about the rain? <laughs> what are you doing? What's this little chicken doing? Hey there. Hey there. <laughs> Where are you going? You want to hang out?
Devil's Castle originates from the myth that an evil spirit or a devil was sighted in the area in the past, which still survives as a superstition among the area's inhabitants. There's not much historical information about Devil's Castle, however they think it might have been founded during the Urartian rule due to its architectural features. They also think that the present castle dates back to the 13th century when the area was ruled by Georgian kings, which leads to a famous legend. The legend says a daughter of a Georgian king was buried somewhere inside the castle with gold and other treasures. Because of that, the castle suffered a lot from illegal treasure hunting. Hey guys, despite all the troubles I'm having with my bike right now, a place like this makes it all go away. These are places people dream about going to, they dream about seeing, but they, they never do it. They spend their whole lives working. If you don't get out and travel while you're young, you're not gonna travel when you're older. You're just gonna stay in your comfort zone. Get out, buy that plane ticket, buy that travel book, anything that's gonna get you excited to travel. Maybe even buy that bicycle with the panniers. There's more to life than working. And as you can see, you don't need a lot of money to travel. I spend a few dollars a day when I'm traveling in Turkey. Other countries I spend maybe five or six dollars a day. And if you're thinking you have to stay in that five star hotel, you're wrong. You can make your own five star hotel. It's up to you. Traveling can be as cheap or as expensive as you want it to be. You hold your limits. I want to encourage you all to get out, to travel, to do more, to see more. Until next time. If you made it this far, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like it, share it, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next video.